Hi everyone, so today I'm going to share with you 10 series that I want to start but haven't yet. And in fact, I haven't started these ones because I don't own them yet. So the first series that I want to read is Le The Legend series by Marie Lu. I've been planning on reading the series for a while, but every time I turn around, I, I always end up like, you know what, I just want to buy the entire box set so I don't ever actually end up picking the first one up. And but it's basically, I'm still deciding whether or not I want to pick up the box set or just get each book individually, and that is what is stopping me from reading this series. The second series is the Shatter Me series by Tahara Mafi. I was going to pick up Shatter Me a long, long time ago, back before even the second book was out. And I didn't, I remember walking to the shelf, picking it, reading it, being like, I'm going to get this, and then at the last minute I decided against it. And now I keep hearing everyone talk about how great it is, and I'm like, why? Why didn't I buy it then? Uh, so I do really want to read that series. The third series is the Jimma Doyle series by Libba Bray. Uh, I was going to buy this book back when the first book came out. It was in a uh, book order that I was going to get, and I just didn't have the money for it at the time, and I kind of forgot about the series for a long while. And then someone brought it up to me asking if I had read it, and I realized I hadn't, even though I had wanted to, so that is... So it was just like a reminder of the series that I wanted to read a long time ago, and it still sounds really interesting to me, so I, I do want to start that series. The fourth series that I want to read is the Heist Society series by Ali Carter. This is a series about teenagers who go around stealing stuff, and um, it's very much in a genre that I... I don't read a lot in, but every time I read something in it, I enjoy it. The fifth series is the Eve series by Anne Carey. I want to read the series because I don't hear a lot of people talking about it. I think I've maybe heard one or two people talk, talking about it. So there is no real expectation behind the series. And I really do enjoy going into series without knowing a lot about them. Um, it, it gets very disappointing when you read series after series that everyone says they love because everyone loved it so much you just find yourself disappointed in it because it didn't meet your expectations because going in without expectations sometimes is really nice. Six is the Infernal Devices series by Cassandra Clare. I read three of the six Mortal Instrument books and I am not too impressed with them. I'll probably continue the series just because of how popular the series is and because Everyone says that the Infernal Devices is somewhere between better and significantly better. Oh my god, you don't even have to read the Mortal Instrument series to enjoy the series better. So I am going to give those three books a try and hopefully I will enjoy them more than I enjoyed the Mortal Instruments. Seven is the Guards of the Shadowland series by Sarah Fine. I actually won this book through a Goodreads giveaway, a Goodreads First Reads giveaway, so I'm really excited to read the series. Eight is the Daughter of Smoke and Bone series by Lainey Taylor. I've heard very mixed things about this series, but I find almost every time I read a series that has mixed reviews, I almost always fall in line with the positive reviews of it. And I believe the series is now complete, so I can just read them all at once if I decide to. Number nine is the Across the Universe series by Beth Revis. I have, haven't been reading a lot of space sci-fi recently, and um, I do really miss the genre because it's kind of a genre I grew up reading. Uh, not just reading, but like watching on TV and watching in the movies, and I, I feel like it's a genre I've sort of... It's walked away from and I really miss it so I do want to read the Beth Revis trilogy because it does start out in space and the final series the 10th series I want to start is the Throne of Glass series by Sarah J Mass and I want to read this one because this is a series that's kind of going around booktube right now and I do kind of like staying up with what everyone's reading, just not doing my own thing all the time, although most of the time it's pretty awesome. Anyway, those are the 10 series that I want to start reading but haven't read yet. 